What do we got? We have more goodies that we absconded with from Boardroom Spirits during our recent... No, 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 no. Absconded <laughs> makes it seem as if we took things and ran out the door. We were generously gifted these items. All right, fine. And then ran out the door. Well, yeah. <laughs> well, were you, well, you could have ran. I was in no condition to run. Thank God you were driving. Um, so we grabbed some of these Quaker Aids from Dome Distilling, Dome Distillery in Quaker Town. And uh, so do you think these guys are, they formulate it and then Boardroom Spirits makes it for them? I'm going to guess they probably don't have their own distillery distilling. Or maybe they don't have this part of the distillery. That they contract with other people to do things for them. Yeah. So they're probably using Boardroom to make these. Quaker Aid? Um, Quaker Aids and maybe some of their other products too. Okay. I don't know. Well, this is a pink grapefruit flavored Quaker Aid. Shall I read a little bit about it? I will pour. Okay, about us, our history. Dome Distillery was started in 2020 after owners Susan and Christopher Labonge, I don't know how you say it, L-A-B-O-N-G-E, Labonga, decided to take time to appreciate life's little pleasures. With this renewed focus, they shared time, cocktails, and many warm evenings, evening fires, contemplating how they could work together on an endeavor that they were both passionate about and would enjoy. From Dome Distillery, several RTDs, ready-to-drink cocktails, mm -hmm. And Quaker Aid were born. With just the right balance of sweetness and bitterness, Quaker Aid Classic Lemon started the ever growing trend. So should you. So they have the lemon, but we're trying the pink grapefruit. Pink grapefruit. And they have a, a mango as well? Is that uh, the flavors you said? I'll tell you. Hang on a second. Let me get to there. Let me mango. get to the shop. They have. Drum roll, please. Classic Lemon. They have strawberry. They do mango, peach, and pink grapefruit. There you go. And they are, I guess, six seventy-five a can, is how they start out, and six percent ABV. So nice. it is citrus flavored vodka with natural flavors, and this is the pink grapefruit. Pink grapefruit. Pink grapefruit. I like grapefruit. Cheers. Cheers. I'm a grapefruit guy. I like grapefruit. Not a lot of grapefruit on the nose. Not a lot of anything on the nose. It just smells. No. A little bit of citrus. Maybe. Like a seltzer. Yeah. And, and, just and a little uh, bit like that, it. you get the seltzers. Mm -hmm. Not a lot of carbonation. Yeah. But when you go in, it's like a blast of pink grapefruit. And it's not overly sweet. No, it's, so it is it's, pretty it's tart. Not, it's not the harsh tartness of a, of a real grapefruit. It's the pink grapefruit. A little bit sweeter, a little less There is like no carbonation on this yeah. one, is there? Is yeah. it supposed to be? Uh, I don't know. Well, you know, lemonade's generally yeah. not. They, so maybe uh, this they, is... They don't say soda. They say they're AIDS. So right, so maybe, maybe it's, it's not. Yeah, maybe it's not. That's not bad. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's quite refreshing. Yeah, I mean, you definitely get that big blast of pink grapefruit, you know? Now, we just tried we just tried the gin and tonic. Mm -hmm. I think if it came down to it, I think I'd rather jump gin and tonic. Well, it's a different sort of thing. This well, is, I want that little bit of fizz. This is a, a kind of a, a lemonade, mm -hmm. a soft cocktail. Not even a cocktail, just a soft drink. Mm -hmm. um, rather than get a seltzer or a beer. Yeah. This is probably for the same people who would drink uh, the, hard, the hard teas. Yeah. You know, they're going to drink this kind of thing as well. Mm -hmm. For that same reason, they don't want to drink a beer. They want to drink something else. Right. The, the problem is, though, because it gets, it gets a little tart. You don't get that fizz to kind of cut that tartness, yeah. you know? So I kind of like a little bit of fizz with this. Yeah. If, it was a little, if it was a little bit more carbonated or carbonated a little bit. Or carbonated at all. You like that. Yeah, it, it's not bad. The flavors are good. I just wish it had a little bit of carbonation. Yeah, I think the flavors hold up. You know? I'd like to try the other ones. Well, we could. To see. I don't mean now. <laughs> you sure? I got them right there. Because the uh, pink grapefruit might not be my wheelhouse of flavor, where strawberry or maybe lemonade would be okay. instead of it. So um, I chose uh, four of these. No, 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 no. You chose one. I, you know, I, I think chose. If we'd had the mango, I, I probably wouldn't like it as yeah. much because I'm not a big fan of mango. Okay. Just the flavor. I got you. I got you. Uh, this is good. Um, also rather ingenious because you're able to find somebody that has additional capacity at their mm -hmm. distillery. Right. And you can... So borrow you, time from them. So you think it's like a like a almost like the gypsy brewer yeah, kind I mean, of I guess thing? It's a little bit like a gypsy brewer that you, you know, know? Uh, the folks at boardroom put together their schedule. They have a little extra time and right. they arrange for contract to do some contract distilling for other people. Plus now they've got the canning line, yep. so they can just do it on site yep. as opposed to you know these guys maybe have the distillery up and running, but they can't do everything. All the can so I don't know. I give it like a B. Yeah. I mean it's okay. I don't love it. I'd say it's like an 83, 84 for me. Yeah, I mean, it, it's it's yeah. fine, yeah. but I don't think it's something I would really yeah. look for. Not not this flavor. I would probably look for a lemonade or the this, this strawberry yeah, well, one before I look know, for we'll that. We'll try them in the next session. Because I, uh, 
I'm just not as big a fan of pink grapefruit. Plus, yeah. I wonder if you had multiple cans of this. Yeah. If that flavor would become kind of cloying at some point. Yeah, I got you. Where you'd be like, yeah, I don't want to have a whole bunch of glasses. Right, of right, right. Juice. You're going to have so much. You're going to have so much. So, All right, sir. Cheers. Cheers to you. Cheers to boardroom. Cheers to Doan Distillery.